Hey everybody, this is MG Vids bringing you our latest review. This time we're talking about Dark Slash. So in Dark Slash, you're a hero with basically a lightsaber, which is pretty cool, fighting off the enemy horde, which ranges from what look like zombies to wizards, etc. And you basically progress through waves. So let me just hop in and show you uh, what the game looks like. The graphics are not the greatest. Okay, I, I will be the first one to say that they're they're pretty poor. However, the gameplay is very easy. The controls are really simple to pick up, and this game gets addictive really fast. So how am I attacking? I'm basically I'm tapping on the screen or I tap at the enemies, and I slide basically in a big slash toward them. My character cannot move all the way across, so you see he does stop short if I go from one side to the other. But I can also drag my finger to run around. And I'll show you that one more time. So if I drag my finger, you can see him running around there, and then tap on the zombies and go right through them. Okay. So, you know, really simple to pick up. And like I said, the game is pretty addictive because it's so simple to play and, you know, continue to do over and over again. Okay, the downside of this game is the money piece. Okay. When you first buy the app, it costs 99 cents, which normally is not a big deal. And when you pay that initial fee, you start with three save me's. You see that here. Once you use those three save me's, like I have, the only way to get more of them is to pay 99 cents to get three more. So I think that is just really a huge drawback uh, on the app. Uh, it just recently, the app recently came, just recently was released a couple days ago. So hopefully this is something where you know the developer gets our feedback and yours and will make some adjustments because I think that's just a huge roadblock. I don't see folks playing this game, uh, especially as addictive as it is, just stopping playing the game if you have to pay to get you know three additional savings every time. Um, especially when you're already paying 99 cents to download. You know why, why not just have three lives or or a leaderboard where you can compare and see what your score is. Oh, good, I got that wizard. What your score is compared to others. You can share it on Facebook and Twitter uh, if you choose to. Your score. Um, another weird thing, uh, just to go back to the gameplay for a second. So if I was to turn my mobile device the other way around the screen doesn't doesn't adjust with it, right? So now the game is upside down on my mobile device. So that's another weird thing that uh, typically all games will, you know, it'll just flip over and readjust for you. This game does not do that. So this is MG Vids talking about Dark Slash, which, you know, again, the graphics are not that great, but <laughs> you get past it really quickly because the game is very simple to control, very addictive. However, the big roadblock here is money that you have to pay for additional savings, 99 cents per th for every three, I think is just a little absurd. So hopefully that's something that's going to get improved, approved, improved here in the future. So hope you guys enjoyed this MG Vids with another review, and we'll come back at you soon with something else. Thanks a lot.